Hi YouTube, welcome back. <sighs> busy, busy day. Stay tuned. So I work part-time Sunday through Tuesday. So most of my outside gardening stuff is done Wednesday through Saturday. But this week, this is Wednesday, this is our only nice day for the week. No rain, supposedly. Of course, if any of you are on my Facebook page, you know that that's not always the case. Um, supposed to be no rain high of 80 or 82 something like that so it's gonna get really warm today but the rest of the week is all thunderstorms so I'm gonna try and get as much done today any of you who have a YouTube channel you know that things go a lot slower when you're filming it so this is all you get <laughs> I am going to work off camera and get as much done as I can, and we'll check back after the day is over this evening. So stay tuned for that. Well, it's starting to get dark, so I guess I'm done working for the day. Come see what we got done. I planted some sweet pea flowers there. This is by my front porch, hoping that they will come up and go around the pole. I planted the last round of peas over here on the trellis. Over here, I planted just on the one side, the first round of cucumber, because it's still a little chilly for cucumber, so we'll see how it does. Still gotta do the other side and the other section. We weeded some, of course. In the empty looking holes, I planted alyssum flower seeds. I transplanted some pansy that I had growing. A little bit of weeding as I went. Obviously not all of it. There was some more flower seed there. Some other pansy. Here in the little bed I planted some lettuce. Uh, three different types. Each row is a different type. Now the reason it looks like there's toilet paper or something stuck in there is because there's toilet paper in there. I took a single ply sheet of toilet paper, well not sheet, but a row, and I stretched it across and put the lettuce seeds on top of the toilet paper and then covered that up with soil because we're going to get heavy thunderstorms the next couple of days. Hi buddy. And I didn't want the seeds to get washed down too far. So I'm hoping that the toilet paper will help keep them in place at least long enough to start sprouting. I put the garlic that I had in the refrigerator in the ground. That's in a different video because it was part of an experiment. But I transplanted my thyme, my dill, and my hand, <laughs> and my garlic chives. There is four runner bean seeds planted in each brick at the bottom of this trellis. If you missed that in a different video, I put this trellis over here near the tree so that when it starts getting hot out, they'll have a little bit of afternoon shade because I read that runner beans don't like it hot. They like to stay cool. But they're planted in the ground, ready to go. I planted these very lovely lawnmower parts, hoping that they will sprout working lawnmowers. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, we have a grinder. <laughs> something will work. I got my cilantro transplanted over here. 
and the parsley, the first round, the ones that survived, transplanted over here. They'll get company soon. It's like the 4th of July. Boys and their power tools. All right, well, that's a wrap. Uh, I think we did pretty good today. Got a good bit done. While it's raining the next couple days, I'll do some inside stuff. And um, thanks for coming along with me today. And remember, life's an adventure. God bless. <laughs> thanks for joining me and mine. <laughs> now God bless. God bless. <laughs>